Hey what's up this is Scott with Level Up Tuts and today we're going to combine a couple of things that we've learned in the past few videos. So what we're going to do is we're going to download and install a plugin that contains a widget that we can then use to add some additional functionality to our site. Uh, thus proving how exactly flexible WordPress is through plugins and widgets. So we're going to go to plugins and then add new just like we have before and the plugin we're going to grab is WP space recent and then views. Now we search for this it should be the top one here and I'm going to go ahead and click install now. So what this is going to actually do is display a list of the pages that you've visited recently. Now this time I'm going to go ahead and click activate plugin from this screen and our plugin should be there. So not only can we use a like a tag in one of our posts to display this but it gives us a new widget that we can find under appearance widgets. So if you remember we came in here we added our own tag cloud and stuff like that. Uh, and now if we scroll down, we should see recent views. So this is our new uh, widget. So this was not here before. And we can go ahead and say that we want this to show up in the primary sidebar. Let's click add widget. And now for fun, let's just put this at the top. And we can see that if we click on this, it even gives us some options. Um, and we're going to select this to be Ajax so it updates. Um, I'm not exactly sure. I'd have to look at the documentation to see what exactly it's doing with Ajax. Uh, uh, and then, you know, we can give it a new title. So, recently viewed pages. And we can say, yeah, leave it at five, or you could extend the number if you wanted to. We'll click save. Okay, and this should be saved. Now that we come to our page, let's give it a refresh. And it says recently view pages. There are, we haven't been to any. So let's go ahead and click around the site a little bit. Okay, we've been to that page. Now let's come to the author post two. Let's come to about, back to home. And you can see that we now have recently viewed pages as our author post and our test author post. Now, what you'll notice is that it's not actually having the about us. Well, we can solve that by coming into uh, plugins. And if we go to our list of plugins, you remember we have settings. So I said before that you'll notice that a lot of these have settings right here. However, some of them don't. Some of your plugins that you're going to install won't, right? And uh, you know, that doesn't mean they don't have additional settings. In fact, for this one, if we come to our settings menu over here, we not only see our standard things, but we see recent views in here. So that's one thing to notice. If there's not like a settings button there, feel free to look around your admin and it might have added it there. Now you'll see that under post types, only posts were checked. So now if we check pages, and we can save this. Uh, when we come to About Us, it's now added to our recently viewed pages list. So now we've extended our site further by adding a plugin and using the widget that comes within the plugin to do some things that WordPress could not do out of the box and we didn't have to touch code. So that's awesome. We now have pretty much everything we need to uh, create and manage a, a WordPress site and get it theming and just, you know, move things around based on whatever theme you're using. So as always, this is Scott with Level Up Tuts. If you have any questions or comments, please leave a comment in the video, reach out to us on Facebook or Twitter or the Level Up Tuts forum, and I'll see you in the next one.